I'm just tapped up and two twenty nine. Recap this game was provided by the developer. Um, this game describes itself as a magical realist point and click game that follows the personal experiences of Bo and Al. I'm pretty sure a cat is purring directly into my ear socket right now. My plants look sad. Oh, there's a cat. That's why. There's a very loud and very close cat. Like, it feels like a cat is wrapped around my skull, like, attempting to pop my skull like a grape with its catness. My plants look sad, and I keep wondering if I need to water them more often. The succulents' roots are slowly rotting. I don't want them to die like the others did. Then, then water them, or, you know, whatever. I don't know, plants. What is this? I got lotus things at my feet. Oh, that's just where you want to walk to. I guess it's a fern, not a lotus. Mr. Cats. Mr. Mr. Kitty. I can't. I can't interact with the cat. How do I... Oh! What's this? Ow's messy desk has really been stressing me out. I feel really bad that it does. It's not like it's their fault. Of course, I never tell them any of this. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I kind of get a little twinged want to go brrr, clean out of it. Brrr. Um, how do I, oh. oh, you gotta like walk over to a thing and then I guess it tells you what's within interaction range. What is this? What is this? Just like a pillow for sitting? Like, this is not a bed. I don't know what, I don't know what this is. It's like a sitting shelf. Uh, what is this? This thing is full of music and artwork I never finished. Oh, look at this fancy. The, 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 the fairly odd couple, I guess. Abandoned worlds and NPC files. One day I'll manage to find a use for them, I'm sure. There's so many uncharted areas that need to be mapped. Gardens won't grow unless I tend to them. I know that all too well. How dramatic. It's probably just the same thing. A familiar tune plays. Ah, yes. The sound of vinyl and no music. Personally, it's the most authentic vinyl experience there is. This cat is very loud and inside of my skull. I think the cat started outside of my skull and now it's in, in there too. And I'm not sure where I stop and the cat begins. The poster of the poetic... The poetic mage reminded me to see my soul as an arboretum. Sad it groans. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, my brain. All my other guitars are broken now, but this still one still works. Oh good, my brain is back. It's been a year, a year since I <laughs> I think there are vines growing in the electronics! I'd fix them if I could find the time. And the soldering iron and the sick guitars. Huh, what is this? I think that just gives you a choice, but yeah. It's been about a year since I've written anything. I guess I never really felt like I was good enough. Aw. I've got some good old-fashioned... Hush syndrome. Oh, this cat. It's inside my head. I'm playing this with headphones. Maybe it's too it's too immersive to have headphones. Cause it's like it's inside my head. Oh! Hey friend! How you doing? Are you Bo? Is this Bo? Wait, no, I'm Bo. This is oh, Edith. Oh, this is Lou, apparently. I moved in a little early. Your flatmates haven't taken all their stuff yet. I've been needing somewhere to stay after I got kicked out of my last place. I hope that's cool with you. I'm like some kind of gigantic deer centaur. Of course it is. I knew you'd understand, Edith. I I didn't I didn't mean to click that. Bo. I'm I'm definitely not Edith, I'm Bo. You should try to be more confident, Edith. Oh. That's just repeat. Of course it is, and uh, I don't. My, my, my brain. The sound. Might need to take off the headphones for this one. What? What is that sound? Where's the door? I guess it's here. I'll try to escape. Can't seem to do anything else in here. This is apparently a prequel to some game called. Uh, no Longer Home, which sounds like a sequel to Gone Home. How do, I, how do I escape Lou's chamber? 
You have the best bed in the house, and you're not even sitting on it properly. You, you insensitive monster. Oh, here you go. Wait, where is the door? Oh, it's there. Okay, so you use the arrow keys and you can rotate stuff around. Oh, I see. Wait, my own, the exit to my own home is locked. It's fine, I don't, I don't need a key. I don't need a key, I, I don't need to leave. Let's see what's on the other parts of this room then. Just some good old fashioned wall crap, I guess. Nothing too exciting. Is that a lizard? There's a little lizard man on my thing, on my guitar. Which, isn't that a bit short for a guitar? I don't know, I don't, I don't guitar. There's cats inside my brain again. Okay, they're good. The cat has fallen out of my ear. I don't know what this is. Just like garbage, it looks like, it looks like it's a pile of like that stuff, the tape inside of a VHS tape. Like somebody just gutted a VHS tape and just the the VHS gore is what's in that thing. I'll put my hands in there. The rack holds many shower products, different potions. A love potion left by previous tenants. Bottled labeled how to disappear completely. A warning reads, Tiffany's potions advised. This potion's effects are irreversible. Once taken, you will cease to exist. This does not sound like a particularly good potion. Uh, I'll take that love potion. Sure. You never know you'll need it, you know, declog the toilet. Below the surface of the water are many worlds expanding and then disappearing forever. That is certainly one way to interpret a toilet. Wh throw away your paper towel rolls, dude! What What is happening? I'm not zooming in, it's just doing this. I think I'm sinking into the- oh, oh, oh! That's a problem. Oh, my water bill's gonna be immense. Oh, I hate when this happens. This is gonna be expensive. Uh, there's hurricanes in in my bathtub. I told you guys to not let hurricanes build up in the bathtub. But you didn't listen to me. You never listened to me. Okay. Sorry. The, the universe just kind of melted, but we're fine now. The universe has unmelted. Um, oh, that was that was for the bath. I thought that was pointing to the toilets. I was. <laughs> I thought we were going to explore worlds in the septic tank, but apparently not. We should probably be glad that's not what happened. Let's look in the mirror. I can't see myself! The mirror shows a reflection. Deep. Alright, let's go into the open door, I guess. Ooh! That was a blender inside my head. This is a very loud flat. Oh! 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 We looked at the TV. Oh, it's coming out now. All of existence is doomed. The, 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 the deer skull. What wisdom do you have to impart on us, Mr. Deer Skull? Oh, Satan demands you. And he just flips right out of the TV. I hate this channel. Oh! And we're in space. What's your favorite part of space? Mine is space. It's very big blocky stars. Do you ever watch TV and just, this happens? That's why I'm not allowed to turn on the TV anymore. Look at this rug. This is a nice little rug. Oh, it's louder now. Okay. What is this? Oh wait, let's, there's a person here. Is this, is this Ow? Hey, that fruit still hasn't been thrown out. Looks that way. <laughs> looks that way! <laughs> yep, it's there! I'll, I'll, I'll be away from this before too long. I will miss it though. Yeah, me too. The fruit? Is everyone up for that barbecue tomorrow? Liam can't take it. Can't make it and Nana said she'd be late. You sure you're still up to it? Uh, I'm sure they'll be happy to see you, I guess. I know they will. Never feel like I have any, anything interesting to say. Same. What's this? Hey. That fruit still hasn't been- I was expecting the other thing! I'll throw it away before I start cooking. Thanks. It's supposed to go the flies hanging around. Oh, I just- I didn't mean to do this. Inspect the fruit. The fruit has been there for weeks?! Ah! Oh. Of course it didn't get eaten, it, it rotted after week one, bro! Oh man. Ugh. 
I get enough fruit flies from like non-rotten fruit. Come on, man. The rice in the cooker is old. Out of the ends of rice are sprouting ferns with their leaves all curled up. Ugh. I don't like this house anymore. Oh, the laundry cave. There could be dead bodies in here, and no one would ever know. Hold on, I wanted to check out one other thing in that room first. No, 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 go to the door, bro. The door. The door. Go, go to the- yeah, there you go. I do really like the, uh, the art style of this game. Oh, uh, crap. I already forget what I wanted to- oh, it was the cereal. What disgusting description does the cereal have? On the shelf with boxes of tea and cereal. Jars of dry dirt and sand from hourglasses that ran out of time. Oh yeah, that's, you know. Standard kitchen stuff. I don't want to. I don't need to see the TV again. Oh, is this outside? Oh, the cat's inside my head again. Let's finish exploring the inside of the house first. I'm so tired of these cats drilling directly into my skull. The poster portrays many beasts drawn by the digital monarch. I see. <laughs> I'm a very bland book not to be read. Every page is packed with text and tiny handwriting. There's hardly any white space left. Ugh. Sounds like an unpleasant read. Beasts of the Eighth Dimension. I was really interested in this stuff. I love looking at their doodles of different beasts. Skate and die. This book doesn't even have text. Only pictures of skateboarders falling into pitch black holes. Amazing. Probably belongs to Al. That sounds like the best book. Um, no, I already saw those. Alright. I bought this for Al's birthday. That was before they moved in. We ended up never buying an amp for it. I guess we'll one day. These people love just the sound of empty vinyl. Is this even what you would hear if you played, like, a record with nothing on it? I've never tried that. What is this? This place is such a mess. I really should clean this place up. I still gotta put that shelf on, on our side of the bed. Oh. Sleep together, huh? Okay. Hmm. Nothing in here. Can I, can I inspect the lamp? What What is this little lamp station? How fancy. Is this a TV? What is, what is this? Let me see this. Oh, it's like a clothes hamper, I think. Ow, suitcase. That is not a suitcase. That is that is the world's largest suitcase. Reminds me they're leaving. Japan is a long way. I've never been outside of Europe. Things could be different if we both had money. We'd find somewhere together. Nothing big, just somewhere nice. Nothing fancy, nothing fancy. So this is what Europe is like. With the rotting fruit. The cat's burrowing slowly inside of your skull. Ah, there it is. It's very warm with this cat inside my skull. Very warm. Reminds me of mother. Let's go pet the kitty. I'm so slow. Do any other buttons? Ooh! WASD also moved the perspective. Oh wait. No, it's actually Q and E that moved perspective, oddly enough. Well, not super oddly, but... My neighbors bought this after we had our last barbecue last month. They never used it. Then they never used it. At least we won't have to put up for them for much, much longer. That's one bright side to all this. I miss this place though. I wish everything wasn't so unfinished. So unresolved. But we could have it could have been our own fortress. Look at this nice eternal night we've got going on. I I would I think I would pay a premium to live in the eternal night zone, personally. As long as it's not too close to Casinopolis zone. This guy's loud. I'm excited for the next barbecue. Went well into the night last time. It would be nice to go on a trip together sometime. Let's stay at my parents' bungalow in the forest. Oh, you have a parent forest bungalow? Hell yeah. Also, that is uh, the, 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 this guy's having a cookout, not a barbecue. You, you're not allowed to sit, call that a barbecue in the south. Oh, what's this? I spent so much time weeding the flower bed, never maintained it. Seems like there are even more weeds than before we moved in. All the flowers are planted together have been swelled up by the Alcanet and Enchanter's Moon Nightshade. Why do you have poison 
in here. Uh, never mind, that's not even the strangest things we've had in this house. Tiny swamps have formed in the bottles outside the bedroom window. That is awesome. Alright, can I... There's no way to leave this courtyard, is there? We're, we're trapped here forever. I guess the exit is that locked door. We really are locked in here forever. This reminds me of... Oh man, what was that game's name? There was another... Like, it was a pixel art and flat style game that had a lot of vibes like this. I'm still mad about the neighbors stealing our mop bucket. They give her for the constant howling of the previous neighbors. <laughs> Did you have actual banshees as your neighbors? I guess I can't go assault the neighbors. Why is there a door here? Like, this is just a door. I'm just, just there. Oh, the cat's back. Is that all there was to see? I'm not sure. I don't remember if this game is free or not. Um, let me open this up. Play supplemental prequel. Oh, there's another prequel. There's Fiery Road. I might check that out. Um, more information. Um, uh, status is in development. Let me... How do I... Open in web browser. There we go. Play supplemental. Oh right, this is a beta. I'm I'm stupid. I forgot to read this. Um, you can currently access this beta um, if you subscribe to their patron, um, and they've got a free little prequel sort of deal. So this isn't final or like complete or whatever. And it's a prequel to another thing, but it has a prequel itself. It's prequels all the way down, my friends. I I don't know if this is all there is to see right now. I'm surprised there's no interaction points in this... Whatever this is. Oh! The door is clearly open! How is it locked? That, it, there's literally no way this door is locked. That's probably, like, just not complete content or something, I guess. Mm. Oh, and I like the... In, on Itch.io, the the website where you can download lots of cool indie games like this one um it uh it, you can name you can give a custom noun to your game or whatever like you know if it's like a bundle you can call it a bundle this game is referred to as a house this house is currently unavailable edith i moved in a little early flatmates haven't taken all this stuff yet i've been needing somewhere to stay oh yeah i already saw you so this is this is kind of a peek. Let me see. I think I have my email of this somewhere. I think there's some information I was supposed to bring up. Uh, let's see. We are Humble Grove making 29 semi autograph semi autobiographical, very semi magical realist point and click, focusing on two transgender non binary people with recent graduates who are planning to move out of their current flat. Probably because it's full of like. You know, cats inside of your skull and horrible, rotting fruit fly messes. Two characters based on the two of us and our own experiences post-graduation, such as the Disappear Potion. Can I use the Disappear Potion? Take the Disappearing Potion. I don't think you actually take them. It is partway through development. This build demonstrates how you'd move around the flat and how you would move around to reveal the character's thoughts. Oh, the current, the final game will have you jump in between the two characters and a linear narrative flying up to the point just before the two moved out. We are planning a free release of 29 on our Itch.io page for PC, Mac, and Linux. So I guess this is all there is to the uh, current beta, but uh, I really like, dig this visual style and uh, it's kind of like, a semi-absurdist view of, you know, the college graduate struggle where, you know, you got swamps growing in your thing. I kind of like that deliberate exaggeration of, you know, nasty post-college life where you're kind of, nothing's quite in order yet, and a cat is burrowing slowly into your ear holes. That is my favorite part of post-college. Anyway, this is 29 um, in its current state. Um, I think I'll have to check out the uh, final version when it's uh, actually all done. Yeah, that's it for now.